What's up, everybody? So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and break down the file a little bit of basically what needs to be done for in order for Oscar Valdez to defeat Shakur Stevenson. Now, people have compared Shakur Stevenson to the great Floyd Mayweather. I don't think there's anybody to compare Floyd Mayweather to. Mayweather is one of the best to do it. He is an innovator of that style. And anybody else after him is just trying to be like Mayweather. But um, Oscar Valdez is a different type of fighter. He reminds me of uh, kind of like a Canelo slash, you know, Julio Cesar Chavez. But for the most part, he's just a typical warrior Mexican fighter. Um, this is side-by-side -side training of him and Shakur Stevenson. You know, they're just doing random uh, mitt work and stuff like that. But in the videos that I'm about to show you, I basically, it's kind of favored towards Oscar Valdez because he is the underdog in this fight, even though he is the A-side. Shakur Stevenson is expected to win. Everybody thinks that he's going to annihilate Oscar Valdez. So what I did is I... For me being a professional fighter, former professional fighter, I'm giving y'all my opinion on what I think he needs to do. So, I mean, right here, they're both um, sparring. Oscar Valdez is sparring Canelo, and Shakur Stevens is sparring a teammate. But yeah, so in these videos that you're about to watch, um, I'm putting in their Oscar, uh, Oscar De La Hoya versus Mayweather and... Maidana versus Mayweather, just so y'all can see what it's going to take for Oscar Valdez to beat Shakur Stevenson. So just keep that in mind, keep an open mind, and enjoy what you're about to see, and enjoy my audio, because I will be commentating during these videos. Alright y'all, so I chose the Oscar De La Hoya versus Mayweather fight to kind of show you how Oscar De La Hoya laid the blueprint on how to nullify Mayweather's style. This is going to come into play when Oscar Valdez fights Shakur Stevenson. Watch how Oscar De La Hoya smothers him. He's constantly smothering him, keeping him against the ropes, and just throwing flurries. He's making him very uncomfortable, doesn't give him very much room to counter. Every once in a while he will counter, and you'll see in a minute, but... For the most part, he's um, basically almost brawling with him. You know what they say? You know, boxer brawler, brawler boxer. So he, that's what he's. That's what Oscar Delo is doing. So right here, he's gonna get, get him against the ropes, throw some flurries, throw some flurries. Boom! Mayweather throws two can beautiful counters, but Oscar Delo stays on him. Flurries and flurries and flurries. and doesn't stop. And here's a slow-mo. One counter. And I think he throws one more. Okay, then. But again, he has him back against the ropes. And he's just putting it on him. He's smothering his offense. That's what you have to do to nullify that style of fighting. That running style. Quote-unquote running style. That defensive style. I mean, not all those are landing, but it's looking good to the judges and to the fans. And he could easily have stole those rounds. Another fighter who did even better was Maidana. He was a lot more physical. He bullied Mayweather. I really thought he won that first fight. He was throwing those clubbing punches like that one right there. And he was really putting it on Mayweather that whole fight. Mayweather had his moments, but for the most part, Maidana bullied him and kept his back against the ropes and really made him pay. I'm talking about body shots, head shots. He really, really did not stop fighting and did not stop pressuring Mayweather. I believe this is Mayweather's hardest fight besides Kodo. But that's what you have to do to nullify that style of, fi that style of fighting. And that's what Valdez will have to do to Shakur Stevenson if he wants to be victorious, in my opinion. I'm sure that they have the plan ready, but look, once again, he's, and look how he, 
He's not following Mayweather. He's cutting off the ring. That's the main thing. He bum rushes him, makes him uncomfortable, puts that head in his head in his face, and just throws bombs. Mayweather being you know, picking him apart when he can. But here comes Maidana again. Up against the ropes and putting that pressure on him. And see how he how he doesn't how he doesn't necessarily follow him. He cuts the ring off and just puts that pressure on Mayweather and doesn't stop. That's what Valdez is going to have to do. Valdez does have better head movement and better boxing, in my opinion, than Maidana. But this is the type of style that nullifies that Shakur Stevenson slash Mayweather type of you know style. As you can see, Mayweather's trying to um, land those little short punches in there, but you know. When you're smothered like that, it's hard to do. And I was going to add the uh, Castillo versus Mayweather. But Mayweather did break his hand in that fight. So I didn't include that footage. But yeah, so I hope you all enjoyed that that breakdown. Um, please like, subscribe, and comment. And I do try to answer all the comments on my videos. So yeah, like, subscribe, comment. Thanks everybody. God bless.